A pun is a play on words, sometimes using different meanings of the same word, and sometimes using the same meaning or sound of different words. An oxymoron is a figure of speech combining two contradictory terms. O oh, Romeo, Romeo, wherefore art thou Romeo? That was an example of a monologue. A monologue is a part of any drama where a single actor speaks alone. A prologue is an introductory speech preceding the first act of a play. Stage directions are comments on when and where the action happens. Tone is the general emotional atmosphere. To be or not to be, that is the question. Whether tis nobler in the mind to suffer the slings and arrows of outrageous fortune. That was an example of a soliloquy from Shakespeare's Hamlet. A soliloquy is a speech spoken by a character in which he expresses his thoughts. It is not spoken to anyone, but the audience can hear the character. Asides are remarks spoken to the audience that are not heard by the other characters. An example of an aside is in Shakespeare's Hamlet. In the first act of this play, when Claudius talks to Hamlet by calling him his son and nephew, Hamlet, in response, makes an aside by saying, a little more than kin and less than kind. A comedy is a play intended to make the audience laugh. It is amusing and entertaining. Two of Hamlet's comedies are A Midsummer Night's Dream and Twelfth Night. A tragedy is a serious play with an unhappy ending. Usually the hero is defeated by forces that are stronger than he is. One of Shakespeare's most famous tragedies is Romeo and Juliet. Acts are major divisions in a play. An act is divided into scenes. When a scene changes, there is a change in setting, time, place, and situation.